Good morning, everybody. We are on our way to the homestead to see if we can get our driveway cleared. Past couple of days, we had 18 to 20 inches of snow come down. So Rich has to get the Kubota done today. Yeah, so there's really only a couple more things I have to do. Just grease a few things, check the tires, assemble the chute, and get that whole thing connected to the tractor. It should be quick and easy. Our driveway is completely, completely snowed in. Welcome to our channel. I'm Kathy and that's Rich and we are living off grid in the Adirondacks of New York State while building a homestead from scratch on 135 acres so we can live a simpler life of freedom and sustainability. made it up we're in the garage and Richie's goal right now is to get the snow blower done so all this time I thought I had everything I needed it turns out I do not have the hydraulic chute rotation controls there's supposed to be a motor and some hydraulic lines when I bought this thing and I ordered it I spoke with the salesperson and he gave me everything I needed they have the hydraulic chute deflector control for the deflector right here but I don't have the hydraulic rotation for the chute I called the dealership he was very apologetic he said he would order one right away and give it to me at low cost fast forward to another week I get an email from the dealership. They put a tracking in on the UPS and it turns out that the box was damaged, components missing, and they had to reorder the part. You, know, you can't make this stuff up. So I'm gonna finish assembling it with the manual controls, continue to move on. The subframe is all hooked up. I got everything greased. The shaft looks great. The bolts are all tight, as tight as I can make them. So we're good to go. I'm just gonna check my hydraulic fluid because I added some lines and just see if I need any more fluid and it looks like it does need some fluid it's kind of low all right well the idea is to get the tractor front tongue and bring it over here and pick that up. hard or not no please no no more hard I got a little bit of snow on the grease but that's okay so all right so this item should now slide into this okay and it should go way up so I have enough room up oh, there goes that stupid chain again so I have enough room Pull back the locking ring and let it snap into place. 
that worked. Oh, thank God. This silly. keeps breaking. How, that's like the third time. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave it off because I don't think it's supposed to be on the way. In the way, they showed hanging. The directions just say unhook it. <laughs> okay, it but broke. Leave this. Okay. Hopefully that won't be a problem. All right, so now we're ready to move some snow. I was hoping that I could use this manual chute adjuster, but all this bracketry is designed for a tractor without a cab. Oh my God. So I can't use any of that. So you can't even do it manually? Well, I can, but I just have to do this. Oh my God. Okay. I'll get it set off well, one Well, you know side. what? It's our property. Blow it anywhere you want. I'm going to go to one side with it and leave it set, and that's it. And I'm going to go with something like that. We're going to have you do some filming. The first blow? Of the first blow. I'm going to film the first blow. Yeah. This for the first time, cross your fingers and let me know what happens. You're turning? No. Now? No. Yes. Oh, because I had the tractor engaged when I get out of the seat, it's got the safety. So I can't even get out to see what it looks like. Why is it so noisy? Alright, ready? Yep. The thing that's making the noise is like that fan thing in the back. The second stage. These turn this way. Right. And the auger is the first stage. Yes. And then the fan that blows it is the second yes. stage. Yes, that stage seems like it's what's making the noise, but it doesn't look like anything's rubbing. I think it's just noisy. Okay, so that's up as high as it'll go right now. Wow, the snow's deep. Right, so I'm going to hit that and it's going to start to blow snow right in your face. Oh, I'm going to go on the other side. Nothing's ever easy. Four hours later, the snowblower is finally working. Yay! He is happy. Good so far.
Well, there it is. Finally in action. The Kubota B2782B snowblower. Does not come with the hydraulic chute rotation. And it is coming soon. Here's the shaft assembly. Everything worked out good. And it fit in the garage with the backhoe on it. I just pushed the backhoe right between the loader. Yeah, I know what you're thinking. Maybe it'll fall down and push on the loader, but it won't because it has that lock hook device that holds it together. So that's it. It actually fits in the garage, the whole entire setup. Next time it snows, we could just pull right out. We got our driveway all cleared. It looks good. We're heading out. It's been a tough day. Anyway, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll see you on the next video. It looks great, honey. You did a good job. Yeah. We have a driveway. Perfect. Nice job, hon. Nice job.